Hello everyone. I want to show you my uh, haul of WordSeek puzzle books. I've been buying a lot of these books called Penny Press Family Favorites. Sometimes I can find them in the stores, closeout stores and stuff. I never have been able to find them in like just a regular bookstore or anything. I haven't seen them. So I started to get them like at the disc discount or closeout stores and then I found their website and um, they had these but now uh, I have the since I have the website to get them off of uh, I'm ordering some now so this is what I got and it is so cool that I got all these books they'll last me forever <laughs> Um, I actually have one of these already. It is a, a duplicate of one I already have, but they sent it, this to me anyway. And, um, there are little, um, back issues, so this is from last year. It was an autumn special, Weird Seeks Family Favorites, and it is about, let's see, sorry about the lighting in here. I don't know how many pages it is. Well, like it goes past 200, so there may be like 300. And that includes answers at the back when you have <clears throat> your stumped. So, and here's another one. It is a, a family favorite spotlight word seek puzzles. I've never gotten the ones that are like spotlight with the pop culture and TV movies and stuff. But, um, it'll be pretty cool to uh, do things like that and, um, do stuff in them. And, uh, <laughs> it'll be very, very entertaining, believe me, to do these puzzles. Plus, it's got other kinds of word seek, like finding words in the word seek without a list of words. Just words that start with T and words that start with M or you know, of the alphabet, so. Okay. Here's one I don't have previous, didn't have previously. It is uh, volume 72, Family Favorites, Penny Press, uh, 275 puzzles. And it is also just kind of a, it's kind of thick, it's pretty thick. It'll last a long time. But um, it is, I look forward to working with this one too. I love these puzzles. I love to do these because my mind, I'm autistic and have ADHD, so if I'm working or listening to something, it helps me to focus. Even if I'm coloring something. Here's in volume 73, Word Seek Puzzles, Family Favorites. This one's also just medium thickness. And, sorry about the lighting again. I don't know how this is, if this is actually focusing. My eyes aren't good and I'm wearing glasses. But, anyway, these are good puzzles to do, believe me. And the goodies are about to come. Oh, I, I really, like, freaked out with excitement when I noticed that how thick these are. That must be, what, an inch? And... It's a giant word stick. I mean, it's got like 500 and some pages. And you've got, you know, missing vowels. Uh, you work with finding the missing letters for the words and put them in the right place. You have to put them in the right place. I can't really focus in on it very well. But these are some really great and, and enjoyable puzzles to pass the time. I suggest if you're waiting a long time somewhere and you're a little bit of an old-fashioned, more old-fashioned, and you like to work in books, maybe not on your phone. I like to work in books because I'm an 80s kid, and so I like to do the old-fashioned stuff. And I rarely play actual electronic games anymore, just once in a while. 
but these will entertain you for hours and hours. And that's is a very thick book. It's a very, very thick book. Look at that. Oh, look at that. And this one is another giant word book, 688, which I'm so thrilled about too. Super thrilled. See, this tells you what kind of uh, uh, word search is in it. Uh, missing lists. Missing vowels. Boxes. Number seek. Wizard words. One and only. And zigzag. So, that will keep me entertained for a while. And while we're here, I'm going to show you my collection, a new collection, actually. Okay, uh, this is Castle Arts 72 count colored pencils they use for coloring. They are really great. They go on smooth. I would say they're almost as good as the Prismacolor in their own way. And you have a bunch of your yellows and tans, pinks, oranges, reds, fuchsias like that, purples, uh, stuff like that. There's like six rows or pockets for these. Here's your blues and violets and greens, your greens. Here is just a bunch. I don't know. These were just kind of put together. You have a few more greens and then you have some tans here. And this one is, it's hard to get the focus in here. Sorry about that. Let's see what that does. Oh, not very much. Okay. So anyway, you have all these to your gray, some of your grays, your, your blacks, uh, your white. And it's really a good uh, combination of colors. I really like them a lot. Plus, I have Prisma colors, and I have Sargent Arts, and I have uh, Faber Castell. But these, these actually came in this thing. The first order I tried to get on Amazon, something happened and I didn't get the order. So I canceled it, and then I got the ones with the same kind of pencils with the carrying case. And I do really, really like it. So I'm going to stick with that, work with these for a while. And then I've got these thick things over here, these thick books that I'm going to be working with. And it will be a great thing to do this fall and winter when it starts to get cold and things start to feel uh, where I feel like I can just chill out in the bed and uh, do puzzles. So if you want these, there's the website Penny Press uh, or you can go to a discount store like Ollie's if you have one in your area. They have some of these used ones. I've never seen the thick ones at Ollie's, but I've seen these. Or just go to the website or Amazon and pick your favorite word search. I love these things. And if you're into coloring, Castle Arts or Prismacolor is good. Anyway, that's it for now. I just wanted to show my haul because I was really, really psyched when... I saw the box out on the porch and I was jumping around like, yes, my books. So I have tons of things to do. Thanks for watching. Catch you later.